new Lowland League season for East Kilbride about to get underway here at the Isle Stadium in Dalbiti with Dalbiti star the first opponents for Stuart Malcolm's Kilby. Daniel Burrows here with you. Let's take a quick look at the Dal BT side reeling, I'm sure, from an 8-0 defeat to Kelty Hearts in their opening league match at the weekend. Got a trialist on the bench, so they will certainly be looking to bounce back from that big defeat for Stuart Malcolm's East Bride. It's a first start of the season for last season's top scorer, Craig Malcolm. He's uh, come off the bench a couple of times, but uh, good to see him back in the squad as well. And a very strong side for Stuart this evening as the teams emerge from the tunnel, led out by tonight's referee, Brian Templeton. Always such a difficult place to come and get a result. Positive result, so that's uh, what Kilby will be looking to do tonight to get their season off to the best possible start. So it is a home side to get us underway on what looks to be a clear evening in Dumfries and Galloway. Paul's Rory really Payton winning the free kick there off of uh, Lee Wells, the Dalbiti number six. This is Connor Bell lining up the shot. Spinning away from goal. One of the WT players just coming into closing down at the very last second there. That may have affected his ability to get a better shot away. Peyton trying to win the ball. It's knocked forward. Bell trying to get it clear. Good challenge by Brotherston. This is Sloan. Decent ball into the box with middle miss who is offside. I think that might just have been cleared off the line in the end there by Ryan Cinnamon. But the flag did go up. Well, one back by Cairns there. It says Malcolm. And this could be a chance. Again, the, the ball is in the back of the net. Flag up again, though. Parker sending that forward for Dalbiti. Bell getting a touch on to it. This is Payton. Still Payton. Back for Malcolm. And just like that, he picks up from where he left off at the end of last season. 1 0 to East Kilbride. And Craig Malcolm back on the score sheet. Great to see, but you got to say, this is great work here from Rory Payton. He looks up. Sees Malcolm in the space. You just need to give him half a yard. That's all it's going to take for Malcolm to have a go at goal. We know how good a finisher he can be. He showed it there. 1-0 Kelby. Degnant losing out there. And here goes East Kilbride. Came through to Payton. But he miscued. Woods driving forward through the middle did well to pick out Peyton. Oh, this could be a chance again for Dalbiti as Thompson launched off the shot, but there was a foul, I think, in there. Just as the free kick came into the box. Michael sending it out wide. Goes the early cross, a chance for Peyton. Couldn't get the clean connection on the shot, and it's claimed by Vinnie Parker in the Dalbiti goal. Dalbiti trying to get this clear. Woods. This is Carmichael as a drive. Well, the exhibits man having a goal there. Giving Parker something to do. trying to get in behind but uh, Craig Reid doing some good defending kicking out Bell and there is the half time whistle here at the Alcroft Stadium and a good first half for Kilby overall Craig Malcolm with his first goal of the season 
putting Kilby ahead at the half-time break by a goal to nil. So it is East Coast Brown to get his going for the second half. Cinnamon. Being played back to Alan Martin who hasn't had a great deal of work to do in this set. Uh, game so far but almost been caught out as he was against Unfermline on Saturday but uh, fair play to the defence there for getting themselves out of a tight situation and this is some encouraging play here Woods driving down to the byline just unable to get it back across he's frustrated with himself but uh, some decent defending in the end by Dalbita, just getting bodies behind the ball. Holmes. Takes out the pass. Here's Peyton. Malcolm and Woods are in the middle. That's a cross goal. Cinnamon chips it in, and Malcolm trying to cut it back towards goal still 1-0 to Kelby here ball almost coming out to Woods and then for Dean Cairns who curls it over the bar Or for pop at goal though Lewis Sloan having a look at this free kick decent strike and it's really well claimed by Alan Martin lots of power did well to get it over the wall Lewis Sloan on target, not much more he could have done. Dean Brotherston. Good play. Sends the early cross in through the box. Shout for a handball as it came back. Brian Templeton not interested in the protests. LBT Star just coming into the game as this second half rolls on. Brotherston takes his free kick and gets a good bit of bend on it. And it's a really, really decent save from Alan Martin. That's the first real save he's had to make in this game so far. And once again, he's on the ball. He's turning into a very, very good summer signing as Alan Martin. Good run here by Brotherston. Degnan. Beatty pushing forward. Early ball chipped into the box. Bit of a clash there. And Templeton, the referee, points to the spot well. It is a penalty to Dalbiti Star as the ball was chipped. It's a simple ball over the top. Collision there between, I think it was Brownlee. I'm not entirely sure who the Dalbiti player was. He went down and a penalty is given. And Martin has done it again. Sloan stepped up to take it. Martin tips it onto the post and keeps it at 1 0. And once again, Alan Martin is the man of the moment. East Kilbride still heading towards a crucial victory. Peyton to Malcolm. Malcolm choosing to go back to Holmes and then Brady plays it square. Strike on goal and a decent one. Dean Cairns having a go and testing the goalkeeper. Not too bad for a centre-back. Brotherston. It's good passing. Dalbiti just trying to thread the needle. Once again, the ball over the top. Wood should keep this in play. Malcolm pulled back. Still Woods. Shot is blocked. And then a foul. You would think in the box, well... That's pretty extraordinary, isn't it? That looked like a certain penalty. Like a clear foul there by the Dalbiti trialist. But uh, Brian Templeton didn't point to the spot on that one. And this could let Dalbiti in for the equaliser. Just about dealt with. Nervy moments here as Kelby tried to close out the game. Almost been caught out again. 
as you say for Martin as Tremble struck it. Nervy, nervy moments as this game draws to a close here. And they'll beat it. Here's the captain, Malcolm on the ball. Just trying to hold on to possession. He's crossing to the back post. A good header across the face of goal. But wide it goes from Paul Wood to knows that he should have finished this one off. Ross Thompson being forced to deal with this ball over the top. Malcolm does well to win possession. Woods, Payton, give and go with Woods is brilliant. Woods going for goal himself. Parker came off his line to save it. Malcolm just having a bit of a go there at Paul Woods, asking for, I imagine, the ball to be played back to him after a brilliant one to. Which might be in again. Almost caught there ahead of Parker, but it's good goalkeeping once again. Both teams pushing for the game's second goal. Payton. Now blocked by Lee Wells. He's desperate for a goal, isn't he? Certainly would deserve it. Putting some very impressive shifts early on in his. Kilby career, this is good football again, it's Woods, back to Payton, still Payton. Payton looking to get the shot off, good drive at goal but it's over. He certainly got that striker's instinct doesn't he? Always wants to find that half yard to have a shot at goal and have too much of a go at him for that. Went to run to... Malcolm Winter continued his run down the right hand side. This is Paul Woods. Woods in a bit of a tangle there. And to clear foul. And the yellow card produced by the referee. And only a couple of minutes left here as Rudy Payton has a look at this. Oh, brilliant. Payton wins the game for Kelby now. Well, it's a goal that he certainly deserves. Both strikers on target tonight. And it's a terrific free kick. Parker guessing the right way, but he just isn't going to get there. It's got everything it needs to go into the back of the net. And that should win it. And it does indeed on the opening night of East Bride season. A tough game. They'll be to win in it for large chunks of the second half especially. But Stuart Malcolm's team get the win. First game of the season. They've won it here in Dalbiti by two goals to nil. And it's the ideal start to the season. Start to the season.